Look, right now, be mindful of yourself because yourself is trying to connect to you, if that makes sense. I know it sounds kind of crazy, right? When you think about it, but you ever had like um, symbolic dreams, uh, been seeing synchronicities, been feeling certain ways and, you know, just changing up from pre patterns of how you used to operate is because you as a soul, as a spirit is evolving. That's why you are not that body. You are merely just embodying that body. Look, you are a spirit and a soul within a body and you are much bigger than that body. And there's so much that's trying to pour itself into you right now. You just have to allow it to come in, allow it to flow. That is what that, you know, when you fast and practice steamer intention, that is what that divination is. You see that spark because your soul is embodying you. Technically, you are embodying yourself. So you are its highest form of like knowledge. You are the highest form of like being of that is. You just have to allow more of yourself to come into you. That is the catch. That is why everything arises in the solar plexus. I'm telling you, yo, it makes sense. We've been looking outside outside ourselves and actually that backs itself up because it's outside yourself is where your soul well the rest of your soul exists it's just that allowing that to en encompass you uh to be inside of you now by releasing all lower vibrational stuff that does not serve you that is what fills you up you got to realize now in order to allow more of your true self to come into you you got to flush out what does not serve you? So a lot of things does not serve you. This is why we're doing the exposed videos. When you release, when you release stuff that is like not supposed to be in, or stuff that's being said, you know what I'm saying? Like trying to, trying to like put down mother nature, like trying to say, you know, sage and tarot cards and trying to, trying to attack those holistic ways that we, that our ancestors always used to use. If you go against, you know, our ancestors, then you can't ever win in this world. Like, and your ancestors is yourself, but that's yourself when you are operating at its form of high self. So that's why your ancestors is always around you because technically that's the pre life that you exist that basically that gathered the experience to come back to this place and then operate from a different spectrum to change it, to be that, you know, that different, that spark, that, um, that creativity that, you know, the, you know, the stuff that we see, the, uh, the talent, the, um, the rarity, the, the difference that we need in this world to that way we bring it up. That's what I'm saying. Is, so you're not that, yo, don't let people try to put that in your head. Yo, we expose up. The veil is releasing. And as this veil lifts, you're going to start to see more and more and more. That's why so much is going on right now. Look at things, yo. I'm saying like, look at Travis Scott a year ago. Karma, right? Now, 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 guess what? His whole empire is shaky. Why? Because now he's supposedly getting out that he's cheating out with this one girl that he's been messing with. You're not gonna lie on me because I've been good. I posted whatever fucking story you guys wanted me to post. I pretended I didn't know you, went along with whatever fucking narrative you guys wanted to, no matter how much like bullshit I got from it. But to say you don't know me and you've never been with me, when you've definitely been with me, when fucking everybody's seen you with me, when I have pictures and videos of you with me, and you had every single girl I know blowing me up, like Trav's asking for you, come back. Are we pretending that didn't happen too? Like, come on, you cheat on that bitch every single fucking night. The whole fucking city sees it. Don't do this. She sounded a little like sure that she been messing with him, but now that's putting the, you know, the whole relationship with Kylie Jenner at a rocky, you know, standpoint. You know, Kris Jenner, she ain't playing with that. You already know this. So I'm saying like people is getting their due justice right now. You're gonna start seeing more things start to reveal itself to you as we start to shift more and more. That is why you see so much trying to distract you right now. Like the more you detach from this physical body, you then can operate on higher planes. You can start to make things maneuver again. It's just that the fact that you start to become more identified, you start to label yourself as, you know, you start to label yourself to everything that we were taught growing up that took pieces of yourself away from itself. So you notice how you start to lose a piece of yourself. You start to like forget your full authenticity. And I'm not speaking of like if you're watching this video, you didn't forget, but you're seeing that 
you're seeing this in your external world. You see the more people label themselves and the more people identify as, oh, I'm this and I'm that and I'm this. They lose a piece of themselves in that. That is what you start to be because you're claiming as that. So you are manifesting that because you're claiming you identifying yourself as that. So this could be anything. This could be uh, I'm a politician or I'm a, you know, I'm a I'm a nine to five or I'm a um, I'm a I'm a single mom. I'm a this could be anything. You know, I'm telling you right now, whatever you identify yourself as that is what you are going to start to vibrate on. That's why you have to lose those labels. You actually have to lose a lot of things to allow your full soul, your full self, your conscious divination, whatever you want to call it. You have more to you that's wanting to gain, gain itself inside of you, get access to you. But you're you're already full. You're already at full capacity because you've identified and you've allowed so much other thing to fill you up now you have to release that i get it now when they're like you have to peel back the layers think of it like a uh, onion you have to get to this root core and to get to the root core you have to peel back all the stuff that you identified and that you attach yourself to and this this will allow you to ascend and level up and not have any low karmic residue that's about to come right now like i like i said yo like i said like i mentioned um i mentioned like like certain artists like Travis Scott. Oh, I'm talking about Young Doug. I'm talking, I'm talking, man, Trending and CJ so cool. All these people are perfect examples of people who put out so much low, low karmic and you're now seeing that as harvest season. So now they have to pay that back. It's just like you acquired a debt at a casino. You have to, if you are negative, if you're in the hole, you know what I'm saying? If you owe them money, you got to pay that back. So whatever amount it is, it's time to pay back. And Guess what? The universe. Karma is the universe. And karma is coming to collect right now. So if you've done good things, if you've been putting out good work, guess what? You about to get you about to get your harvest. You about to get your due diligence. So don't even sweat it. That's why people are trying to take from you. They can see. But if you've been putting out low, 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 shit, that shit about to go, go, go. That's what I said. The first is last and the last is first. Right, yo, I'm about to expose some more people in my next video. We about to expose shit. Trend Genius again. We're going to expose Travis Scott. Toad, that dude. We got to definitely expose that dude. We're going to also expose another cat. Um, what's it called? Marquise Jackson. We, we was exposing him, but he's been doing some more stuff. That's crazy, yo. He trying to set dude up. I think he's doing a snitch nine on him. Yo, putting his text messages out in the media, the public, get attention from ops, you know. You know what I'm saying? Yo, this is this is crazy going on right now. Y'all going to start to see more and more as we move more into these in energy that's happening right now. But, yo, get ready because things are about to move towards the unknown. Yo, we in the, uh, what's it called? It's completion to Scorpio, and this is the unknown. So expect things to happen fast, rapidly, and out of nowhere. All right?